Aha! Actress Omotala Jalade Ekeinde is being dragged on social media over her comment that she made. Come on in, let us dissect, let us analyze Omotala's comment and let us see where she went. channel if you're seeing this face for the first time you are welcome subscribe like and share our video join the family leave me a comment below so I can welcome you properly all right gist lovers let's get into the gist of the day so actress Nollywood actress Omotala Jalade Ekeinde took to Twitter and tweeted out how she was feeling and what she thinks should happen after the Lekki Tollgate massacre. And now she is being dragged online. People are judging her, people are cursing at her, people are saying she's taking bribe. A lot, a lot, people are saying a lot about her. So I will insert the tweet, what she tweeted. I will put it here for you to see what she tweeted out and so you can be the judge so you see for yourself you'll be able to tell why people are judging her if you read through it properly but I will just give you a glimpse so here is what she tweeted and I, I will just read to you the point where I think people are judging her from she said, if people died during the Lekki Toll assault, let their people speak out, please. And if there were no deaths, and if there were no deaths, then enough with the sensationalization because it does not remove from the crime that happened. Peaceful protesters were attacked. Why? By whom? So I think where she said, if, if there were deaths, I think people felt like she's, um, she's making light of the whole situation. Like she's, she's in doubt. Or probably she's trying to say that people are just making up stories. Maybe nothing happened since no family members has, has actually come out to speak. But if you read through the whole text, you will understand where she's coming from this is my humble opinion you're allowed to have yours too okay so don't judge me just leave a comment below and be respectful let me know what you think okay so my opinion is she wants people to come out to speak up because the federal government and the state government is denying the state government said no casualties were recorded the federal government is saying they did not deploy soldiers so but there were people there shooting at, at Lekki Target because there are photos, there are photos of dead people, there are videos and stuffs and stuffs like that. So people are upset that why would she say if, why would she use the word if, if there were deaths, the family members of the dead people should come out and speak about the disease. So I think what she's trying to say is if people really died, their family members should speak up because that will be, uh, you know, further proof that this actually happened and then people can take it up. Because I, um, I saw a post on, on Instagram where someone was saying that they tried to, they're trying to bring up, um, put up a, com a committee of lawyers. So for people that want to take up case and they don't have money, they will have these lawyers that will work for them for free, stuff like that. So... I think it's from that angle that Omotala Jalade Ekeinde is coming from. She's saying, speak up so people can take up this fight. They can, they can push further because if you do not speak up, speak up, then there might not be enough um, evidence to fight because um, when they were shooting, shooting and killing these people, they were taking some of the bodies. So they have just few. They really don't know the exact amount of people that died that night. 
so if people will come out and speak up they will be able to have a clear record and if they want to take it to court they will be able to win their case i think that's the point where she's coming from but i love the fact that she after after she was dragged online she went back and tweeted something else she, she tweeted let me see she went back and tweeted something else I will just read a bit she said i'm deleting that tweet so it's not used wrongly apologies as it's being misunderstood sorry about the use of if and i i, I like the fact that she went back and stated the fact that since people, everybody is dragging her and because she used the word if and she said sorry about the use of the word if and she put it in quotes please don't distrust everyone you know so she's she's trying to tell people that they should not distrust everyone just because some people cannot be trusted and i think this 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 is a good one for, i i love the fact that she came out to clear the air like i didn't mean it the way you understood it this is what i was trying to say but anyways since people people are taking it the other way i'm just gonna take it down so uh, people don't use it for the wrong reasons you know so i think this is fine L leave me a comment below and let me know what you think about this because it has already been said that this will happen and it's kind of surprising it's happening she's not the first celeb that is um other celebs are fighting too some people are calling some other people out and i, and I think this is really taking the youths away from what they should be concentrating on so focus guys focus the fight is still on that's all i have to say leave me a comment below for now i'm out till i have another gist for you all right